seen you for ages. Hi. Where have you been? And you look a bit worried. Is everything all right? Well, I'm afraid I cannot say yes. Why? What's wrong? I am freaking out. I've got lots of things to be done at the same time and I have nearly no time. I mean, I have to finish an important report, I have to call to customers, but I'm having a flight to Moscow tonight for which I need to pack my luggage. Oh, you're really in a difficult situation. But not everybody is good at multitasking. You know, multitasking is dealing with different things at the same time and also trying to accomplish them. And the worst thing about uh, this is that for some people it is a real productivity killer. Of course, you know, anxiety makes the situation worse and how good of you to understand me. You know, you cannot imagine I've been rushed off my feet all morning. And what you are doing now uh, is probably you have turned on your beast mode. Beast mode? What does exactly mean? Uh, beast mode is a state of uh, performing, doing, uh, is, is a state of performing something with an extreme power, skill or determination. And this is a phrase which is based on the idea of uh, when up against a difficult situation or challenge, you unleash your inner uh, beast to destroy any obstacles on your way, but perhaps not transforming into Hulk in <laughs> times of crisis. Mm -hmm. Uh, for example, a patient uh, might go uh, beast mode when fighting against some serious illness like cancer. But uh, for your case, it's like uh, you probably feel anxious because of having very limited time. It's like a simple math. Uh, having very limited time uh, means uh, having more time means that you will get more things done, right? Definitely. But uh, actually it's wrong. It turns out that having very limited time increases the amount of work that you can do. Let's think uh, like this. You have the whole day ahead, but still you'll be less productive because um, you will uh, waste your time by doing some uh, other things like uh, checking your text messages or drinking coffee. And uh, But if you have only one hour to finish a particular task, you'll be more productive. And uh, what will happen in this case? You will completely dive in. Definitely. And uh, a couple of months ago, I also had a kind of problem. And you know, I was going for an important job interview. At the beginning, everything was okay, but later it turned into a real nightmare. And as luck would have it, I got stuck in a traffic jam and almost for an hour uh, I wasted my time there. And as a result, I failed to get to my interview. Of course, later I blamed myself for this, but then I realized that there was nothing to do with it. Like the proverb says, don't cry over the spilled milk. Ah, yeah, I know this proverb means uh, don't spend your time worrying about things of past which already happened and cannot be changed. Definitely. So if you feel like you're about to fail to do something, just let your hair down. <laughs> what? To let my hair down like this. <laughs> no, no, of course. This is a phrase which means just relax and enjoy yourself. I want to agree with you. Maybe I owe take too much responsibility without being aware of it. Yeah, maybe. And responsibility is a very positive quality, but sometimes there can be several things that uh, they are beyond your power. And the only thing you can do is just let your hair down and turn a blind eye. Mm, yes, turn a blind eye means to ignore or pretend not to notice something. Mm -hmm. And remember that everything will be solved sooner or later. Take care. Bye for now.